hi guys and welcome back to the channel in today's video we should be looking at some news from around conan exiles mainly to do with map mods what's been going on what's new what's happening the first map mod we're going to take a quick look at updates is calendar exiles now you can find this in the steam workshop under calendar exiles and the one that you want to be looking at is the re-upload this one here okay the guys have had to re-upload it since um, the original map mod maker passed away they couldn't access accounts so this is the one that you need to be looking at now is the re-upload of calendar exiles now another thing that happened they had their discord um hacked and so they've had to make a new discord as well and you will find the link to their new discord right here in the description of the re-upload of calendar exiles so i just wanted to bring that to your attention guys uh, all the changes it's still been worked on and the changes and everything's been updated but you need to be looking at the re-upload of calendar exiles and the new link to the discord the new discord is right there in the description and the second bit of news and update i have for you is from the mod creator ragnar random who makes ghost of the cataclysm the Daggerlands, etc um, he has now split ghost of the cataclysm into two parts there is an explanation on his discord regarding that and i'll put the link to his discord in the uh, video description you will need to have both parts installed on your server or in your mod list on single player the map will not work unless you have both mods installed so for those of you playing um, Ghost of the Cataclysm you might need to upload things differently now and just things on your server and in your single player and while we're on this page guys under Ragnar Random if you didn't know he's got uh, a factions mod uh, this is where you can also find the Daggerlands mod that I've got a video on I put the link again into the description and he's just popped up this one um, the grey ones undummified <laughs> so i take a look at all these as well guys and of course the steam summer sale is on as well and look at this guys conan exiles standard edition minus 75 percent that's 70 percent 75 percent off from 33 down to 849 there that's a really good price so if you haven't got conan yet guys now's the time to go and grab it but it's not just that We've got all the different content for the game as well. The Isle of Sipta, 25% off. And all the packs, the building packs and the armor packs, um, they're all down as well by 30%. What a brilliant time, guys, to go and pick this up. And also, if you haven't seen it, uh, Player Survey 2 is out. Within the update that came a few days ago, there's a bounty hunting event and DBNO, which is down but not out hallelujah guys we don't have to worry too much about our thralls anymore they're not going to get killed straight away they will kind of go unconscious and then you can revive them but there is a little drawback in that you've got to be very careful because if it happens more than three times then they're lost forever but this is such a huge huge change and it's brilliant for me personally because i'm always losing my thralls as you know if you've been watching me uh, the bounty hunting event is back as well at the at the moment um, and that's all to do with capturing sorcerers and hunting in their skulls there's lots of new um, items to um, purchase as well it's uh, all good fun for those new to my channel and those that don't know i do have a section on my channel all to do with map mods and so far this year we have covered gothic conan wolves beyond the border we did have a good look at Calimdor Exiles. It was on our server for a little while. And we will be returning to that later on in the year. We've done a Savage Wilds playthrough. We've done Isle of Men. And we're going to have a look at Isle of Women as well. And we're currently looking at Ghosts of the Cataclysm. I am always open to exploring new maps for Conan. Because I just love exploring. And I'm very excited to see what people can actually create in the community. If you are a map mod maker and you want me to have a look at yours then please do get in touch and we can do that and with that guys we're going to leave it here today this is a little update on the map mods that i am currently keeping my eye on if you have any further news and that you wish me to cover please do let me know so thank you very much for watching and i hope to see you soon take care guys